How's it going guys? This is Max from Lettering Daily and in this video I will explain what is the difference between hand lettering and calligraphy. These two terms are often used interchangeably but they are indeed two quite different art forms. Before we get started, let's have a quick overview of this video. First of all, I will explain the main difference between hand lettering and calligraphy and I'll provide several examples along with it. I will also explain what typography is and how it contrasts with hand lettering and calligraphy. Finally, I'll share my perspective on why all this matters and finish up with a quick sum up of the whole topic. By the end of this video, you will have a much better understanding of the difference between these two art forms. In case you prefer reading over watching, I also wrote a more in-depth article on this topic that you can find on my website. I'll leave a link in the description so you can check it out. Without any further delays, let's dive right in. So what's the difference between hand lettering and calligraphy? Although both hand lettering and calligraphy are visual art forms related to letters, their main difference is the method used to create the letters. Hand lettering focuses more on drawing and illustrating the letters, Calligraphy, on the other hand, is the art of beautiful writing. In other words, the difference between hand lettering and calligraphy lies in the process and not the end result. In the following example, I will create the same word using almost the same style, but one will be done in calligraphy and the other one will be done in hand lettering. As I mentioned earlier, these two terms are often used interchangeably, but as you can see, the process between them is quite different. Another notable distinction between hand lettering and calligraphy are the tools being used. Calligraphy relies on specific tools such as pointed nibs, broad edged nibs, fountain pens, brush pens, brushes, etc. The tools tend to vary depending on the calligraphy style or script you are working with. Hand lettering on the other hand can be done with pretty much any writing tool. Nonetheless, some tools are obviously better than others. It's understandable that if you're a complete beginner, you will struggle to spot the difference in a final piece, especially without seeing the actual process of creation. With time, you will start developing your eye to notice these differences much easier. Next up is typography. So what is typography? Typography is a visual art form that arranges pre-made letters, aka fonts, in a clear, legible and visually appealing manner. The process involves selecting typefaces, the appropriate sizes, line lengths, letter spacing, kerning and so much more. Even though today nearly all typography work is done digitally, typography using movable type can be dated all the way back to the 11th century. In contrast to hand lettering and calligraphy, typographers mostly work with pre-made computer fonts, like the ones you see absolutely everywhere. A quick side note, when we talk about different calligraphy and lettering styles, we don't refer to them as calligraphy or lettering fonts, we refer to them as styles or scripts. In today's digital age, fonts are what computers, among other devices, use to display text. So why does all this matter? Well, it matters because then we can go around and police people when they use the wrong term. Well, of course, I'm just kidding. The answer to this question is subjective and depends from person to person. As a hand lettering and calligraphy artist, I believe that understanding the terminology and the different art forms is of high importance. These art forms are complex in their own way and they take years of studying and practice to master. Understanding the basic terminology is kind of like ground zero, and I like to believe that you can only benefit from understanding it. Perhaps someone who isn't that invested in this whole world won't really care that much about the different terms and simply call everything fonts. And honestly, you would be surprised to see how often that happens. At the end of the day, the choice is yours and you get to decide what matters to you and what doesn't. It's time to sum it all up. So, as we said, hand lettering is an art form that focuses on drawing and illustrating the letters. Calligraphy is an art form that focuses on beautiful writing of letters. Typography is an art form that arranges letters, aka fonts, in a clear, readable and visually appealing manner. 
Remember, the difference is in the process and not the end result. With time, you will train your eye to spot these different art forms with ease. Now, I want to hear it from you. Do you like more calligraphy or hand lettering? Or are you maybe more into typography? Let me know by dropping a comment below. Also, if you have any questions or wishes for future videos and tutorials, be sure to let me know. I hope this video was helpful for you and if it was, consider leaving a thumbs up and subscribing to my channel to keep up with my future and upcoming videos. Until the next time, stay awesome guys, cheers!